Hi guys, welcome back. As you can see from the title, this is for educational purposes only. This video um, was taken today at the vet's office. Uh, today was Sasha's annual, and what that also involves is getting blood work. Sasha turned 18 years old last December, so um, they have to check her kidneys, her liver, um, her thyroid. She's having some um, health issues right now, like arthritis, drinking a lot of water, and so on, as it comes with her age. So, so to keep an eye on that and to better treat her symptoms, you have to look at the blood work. So if you're squeamish, don't look at this video. If you're curious as to what it looks like when a cat gets blood work drawn, look at this video. Um, it's not for the faint at heart. Uh, this is my first time ever seeing one of my fur babies get their blood work taken. Um, it was uncomfortable, so it will be uncomfortable to watch, but it's the only way to get blood from your fur baby. And these blood panels and blood work will help you take care of your fur baby and also plan something if you need to with your vet to alleviate the symptoms. Like I said, she's 18 years old. She's having some health issues as well as arthritis. So it's better to catch things earlier rather than later to keep them as comfortable as possible. Are you looking for a vein? Yeah. It'd be a little tricky to find with all the fur. Mm -hmm. a little bit more towards me. Yeah. Yeah. You're okay. so good. Yeah, is there any way? Yeah. I know. Just like, do you like this? <laughs> that kind of needle though. You're okay, sweetie. Yeah, I know. I know. Okay. What is that for blood? Yeah, so we're going to try her back leg as opposed to her neck. And so the um, alcohol helps dilate the blood vessel to make it a little more obvious. Also wetting the fur helps too. She has a tiny little vein. You can see how slow her. Very slow. doing really well. 
it was so much work to get wood. It can be in cats for sure. Especially when they're wiggly but she like I said she's being really good. <laughs> you know what? I can make purple actually with them and then I can put a little of my own back and forth too. It's actually feeling a little bit better now. And now we are back home, and as you can tell from the pictures, she is resting comfortably on her little kitty bed. Below that is her heating pad to keep her nice and comfy.